Okay, to get started, I added a clip to my timeline with fast movement that I'd like to add some motion blur to. Let's begin by going over to the effects panel. Then type time warp into the search box and drag the time warp effect onto your clip. Now in effect controls, you should see your time warp effect. First, let's change its speed to 100 since we're not trying to slow down our footage. Then further down, you'll see its motion blur setting. So check Enable Motion Blur. Next, change the shutter control to Manual, and increase the shutter angle past 500. The more you increase it, the blurrier it'll be, but it'll also take longer to render. You also might want to increase the shutter samples, which will make your blur smoother. Again, this will also make it take longer to render. If I try to play this back, I'll see that it's way too computationally difficult for Premiere Pro, so what we'll need to do is make sure our clip is selected and simply press the enter key to render out the effect. It'll take quite a bit of time to render, so this is an effect that works best with short clips. Okay, now when I play this back, I have a really nice looking motion blur effect. But yeah, that's it for this quick tutorial. As always, thanks for watching and catch you in the next one.